When mom took the kids, dad took their things. Next Judge Judy. A bombshell in the defense of Scott Peterson tonight. It's locked. Huh? The door? Uh, no. Then why are you still standing out here? Well, uh, yeah. Oh, I get it. You wanted to carry me over the threshold because you're so sweet. Even though this is like our third threshold. Hey, take me away! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a great idea, Allison. Did you change your mind? Uh, no, but your mother might have. Looking for your wife, Mr. Hughes? Hi, I am. I served her not too long ago. In fact, I was looking for her myself. I she forgot to sign her check. I'll take care of that. Did you uh, happen to see where she went? I'm pretty sure she's still changing. Oh, good. Then uh, I'm going to go find her. No, <laughs> you better let me do that. Um, no man allowed in the ladies' locker room. to say you have everything you need for your police report, right? Right, with a description that basically amounts to generic goons one and two, Dusty. Why are you letting Starziak get away with this? Who's Starziak? Nobody. You have no idea Starziak is responsible for what happened to Lucy? What do you know She knows nothing, because we... Excuse no. me. Let me speak. Starziak was laundering money through the Rose Foundation, one of Dusty's old friends. We don't know oh, this. Oh, so you can give me the information on him. Lieutenant, we don't know this. The hell we don't. Listen, you need a description of this creep, I'll give it to you. I'll tell you everything you need to know. Well, Daddy, I was planning on going back to Montega tomorrow anyway. What does it matter if I leave this afternoon with Mom? But you said... I thought that... Oh. Excuse me. Eddie, are you all right? No, I, I, I have to make a call. He seems pretty upset. Maybe I should just go talk. No, no, no. Let me. So who do you need to call? early, are you? I don't know what to say, Sierra. How about Bon Voyage? She's not going away on a holiday. When my baby gets on that plane today, I'm losing her for good. Hello? It's me. Jordan. How are you? I wanted to arrange to see Cabot. Today. Well, you can't see the baby today. Uh, we're moving to Fairwinds today. That's why I thought it would be a good idea. You'll be organizing the move, and uh, the baby doesn't need to be in the middle of all that. Don't fight him on this. If he wants to see Cabot, let him see Cabot. Cabot is napping right now. Perhaps we could arrange a time for you to see him tomorrow. Maybe I didn't make myself clear. I will be coming to see my son today within the hour. All right, then. I can delay my plans until your visit is over. No, no, that's not necessary. I want to spend some time alone with Kevin. I don't want you there. My hair's totally fried. Come on. I am not going out like this. It's like it's got a mind of its own. Infusium 23 can change that. Now my hair is so soft and shiny. 
I can run my fingers through it. Infusium 23 leave-in treatment corrects, restores, and structurizes damaged hair. Today is a great hair day. I actually finally have good hair. I love it. <laughs> Infusium 23. Believe in, you'll believe it. And to smooth frizzy hair, try new Infusium Complete Frizz Control. You're a toddler now, and you've got work to do. The cleaning, the shopping, and hey, the grass isn't going to cut itself. So really, who's got time to lay down on the job? Well, Pampers has toddler transitions for each stage of your development. One pant you step in for an easy change, another you can pull on by yourself, and a new one that'll let you feel wet to help you learn to stay dry. After all, you've got mouths to feed. Toddler transitions from Pampers. Do you ever lie about your age? No, I'm only 28. Fool even your toughest critics. Olay Total Effect 7X fights seven signs of aging. It also moisturizes better than these major department store brands. Olay Total Effect 7X. Introducing Cascade 2-in-1 Action Packs. Cascade and the grease-cutting power of Dawn. 40% more tough food cleaning power than the leading packet for better results. New Cascade 2-in-1 Action Packs. Wherever scum lives, it will be there. Comet Bathroom Spray. So powerful, it cleans soap scum three times better than the leading bathroom spray. Now in new orange scent. I've made some big calls in front of loud crowds and menacing linemen. I also made the call to go see my doctor and ask about Prevacid. Call now for a seven-day free trial certificate and ask your doctor if prescription Prevacid is right for you. There's something great going around. Something so delicious, people can't get enough of it. It's these reclosable bottles of Ensure. They're great tasting and go anywhere and everywhere you do to give you a good source of complete balanced nutrition to help you stay healthy. Enjoy Ensure as a snack or occasional meal in five creamy rich flavors. Ensure in reclosable bottles. Drink to your health wherever you go. This boy was the most famous missing child in America. After 25 years, has the case of Aton Pates been solved? 60 Minutes 2, tonight at 8, 7 Central. Don't miss super stylist David Evangelista's Mall Makeovers, all this week on The Early Show. What happened with my mom? Well, uh, when I walked in, I, I think she was a little surprised to see me. Oh, that's my fault. I didn't get a chance to tell her that you were coming. Susan doesn't know that I'm moving in here with you? Well, I left her a note, but I guess she didn't get a chance to read it. But don't worry, she's not going to care, Chris. You want to bet? Chris, my mom loves you. And it was her idea for us to move in there anyway. Yeah, well, that was before. Before what? Chris, whatever weird thing my mom said to you, we'll deal with it, okay? Come on. get here? Mom, you know that we didn't just get here. You talked to Chris. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I didn't. Allison, we didn't actually speak. We just kind of saw each other. No, we didn't. Yes, we did. Will somebody please tell me what's going on? You know, I, I should have knocked or Honey, said something. I or, wasn't expecting I... anybody except you, so when he walked in, I certainly didn't mean to be... To be what? Naked. Jordan, you don't know anything about handling a baby. Well, then I guess it's time I learned. Well, you're not going to practice on my son. Whose son? I'm sorry. You know what I meant. Look, I'll wait in the other room. You can have your visit, and then I'll, I'll come out. I mean, I promise I won't interfere. Given everything that's happened, I think it's best if I see as little as possible of you right now. I'm not asking you for the damn moon, Rosanna. Fathers do spend time alone with their kids. But... This is not negotiable. Give me a minute. I can't... I can't do this. All he wants is a little time with his son. With any luck, Cabot will tinkle on his wingtips and throw up on his Armani and you'll never have to go through this again. Jordan, I'm sorry. I was just afraid you wouldn't be able to handle it if 
Cabot started crying or needed changing, that's all. I think I can handle it. All right. Goodbye. I don't like this. You don't have a choice. Jordan is Cabot's father, right down to the DNA. Paul and I never should have kept that information from him. He was so angry on the phone. Well, now's your chance to make nice. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have a good feeling about this. What are you so afraid of? Rosanna, there's a guard posted down the hall. It's not like Jordan can steal the baby. No, that's, that's not it. That's not what I'm afraid of at all. Hi. Oh. So we're back to being discreet? Well, until I can get you alone, yes. Mm. Thanks for meeting me. Sure. You look tired. Oh, well, I spent the night at BRO and I didn't get much sleep. So you're putting some space between you and Rosanna? I didn't want to go back to that suite. I, I needed some time alone to think about everything. Well, did you make any decisions? A few. You know, I'm still pretty ticked off about what Rosanna and Paul did, but that's really not what's important here. I have a son, Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> I know. This is huge. It's overwhelming. Yes, but you'll get the hang of it. Better. Um, did you... Never mind. Never mind. You don't need me grilling you. You have enough to think about. Look, I don't, I don't want you to ever think that there's something that you can't say to me. I might be a little shell-shocked right now, but I'm really glad that you're here. And I'm really glad that I don't have to go through this alone. Me too. So, um... What, what did you want to ask me? Um, did you remember anything else about Cabot's birth mother? <sighs> you know, I, I mean, I, I practically stared at that birth certificate all night. And the name Jane Courier means absolutely nothing to me. I don't know how that could be. I made a baby with a woman. Well, she might not have given you her real name. Yeah, but, you know, I've always been really careful. You know, I don't know how this could have happened. I guess I'm not the first guy to say that. <laughs> so what are you going to do now that you have this, this little baby in your life? I don't know yet, but I want to get to know him. I'm, uh, I'm going to go head over there uh, in a few minutes, actually. Oh. Oh, I'm, I thought that... Oh, uh, do you think we were having lunch? Oh, yeah. I should have said... No, 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 it's okay, it's okay, yeah. Don't worry, you go see your son and have a good time. Do you want to come with me? You, Jordan, you don't have to say that just because... I... No, that's why I thats why I asked you to meet me. I, I want you to be there when I see Cabot. Are you sure? I'm, I'm meeting my son basically for the first time. I mean, how many moments in life are, are bigger than that? I, I want you to be there with me. Really? I wouldn't have known about any of this if it weren't for you. And I don't know how I'm ever going to be able to repay you for that. Do you think that Cabot will mind if I kiss you when we get there? My son would probably think that's a great idea. Well then, let's hurry up and get there. No need to do that. I'm fine. Yeah. This image of you being attacked. Or no, no. I just, uh, you know, I, I, I guess I locked the door by accident, and then I couldn't hear you over the hair dryer. Oh. Mm -hmm. I, are you okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. There's, there's a man in here. Yes, there is. There is. There's no need to do that. I did. It, it's fine. It's, he's a friend of mine. 
Mr. Reese. <laughs> Oh, my apologies. I really didn't mean to frighten you. Oh, no, 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 you, you didn't. It's just a little odd finding you here in the um, ladies' locker room. Well, I can explain that. Well, actually, it's my fault. Um, I needed some legal advice on the QT, of course, and I'm sure you can discern that me being a celebrity, there's some things I can't really discuss in public. Sure. So, Jill, you wanted to see me? I... Yeah, um, oh, <laughs> you forgot to sign your check, and... Oh, I'm so sorry. All right, well, I'm, I'm out of here. But our conversation? I think that we've said everything we need to say to each other, and this never needs to happen again. Um, there. Um, maybe you should go, too. I mean, <laughs> some of the older ladies might have palpitations if they walk in and see you. And the younger ladies? would uh, wonder how they got so lucky. Mm. Jill, is it? Hey. Um, I do hope I can count on your discretion in this situation. In fact, I would consider it a personal favor. Personal favor, I'd be more than happy to return someday. Well, uh, then uh, I won't say a word. Um, in fact, I mean, nobody even knows I'm here except... Oh! Oh! I forgot to tell her. What? Her husband's here. Hi. Tom. Oh, where'd you come from? What's wrong? Um, I didn't expect to see you. I thought you're still in court. Well, honey, you're shaking. I'm so dehydrated. I just finished playing the tennis and... Where's the bartender? I've got to pay the bill. I'm late. For what? I thought you had the afternoon off from work. I do. It's, I've got a lot to do at home. Uh, where is he? Hey, I already took care of the check. Didn't the waitress tell you? You saw Jill? Yeah, I saw Jill. I'm the one that sent her out to find you. Didn't you see her? I did, yes. I forgot. <sighs> Honey, you are shaking like a leaf. There's obviously something wrong. Tell me what happened. Living with genital herpes can be a hassle. Each outbreak felt like it took days out of my life. So I talked to my doctor and found out about Valtrex. Just one pill a day helps reduce the number of outbreaks. In fact, I've been outbreak free for almost a year. It's a brand new day. In a one-year clinical study among people with genital herpes who took Valtrex, at six months, over half were outbreak-free. After one year, a third were outbreak-free. I don't want to lose my days. I want to spend them how I want to. It's a brand new day. There is no cure for herpes. Even with treatment, it may be possible to spread herpes. Valtrex may not prevent all recurrences. To avoid a potentially serious complication, tell your doctor if your immune system is not normal because of bone marrow or kidney transplant or advanced HIV disease. Common side effects are headache, nausea, and abdominal pain. Ask your doctor if Daily Valtrex is right for you. My days are mine, and that's the way it should be. It's a brand new day. The Brita Pitcher filters out the things that shouldn't come with your water, like hundreds of plastic bottles and expensive filtration systems. And all you have to do is this. Britta, just add water. I'm confused. Is that my mom washing with Johnson's? It is. It's new Johnson Soft Wash Body Wash for grown-ups. It's got one-third baby lotion. So now you can have baby soft skin, too. When it comes to an aspirin regimen, doctors will recommend different products for different people. Only your doctor can say what's right for you. If you've had a heart attack, you're at higher risk, so your doctor will often recommend a full dose like Genuine Bear. But if you're at lower risk, they may recommend Bear Low Dose. Aspirin is not appropriate for everyone, so be sure to talk to your doctor before you begin an aspirin regimen. And remember, no other brand prevents more heart attacks than Bear. The more you know, the more you trust Bear. Shh. My secret for visibly fuller lips. It's what I put on underneath. My lipstick. New volume perfect. Lip color from L'Oreal. First it smooths and reshapes. Then the color we contour. Lips look visibly fuller. It's no secret why I use new volume perfect from L'Oreal Paris. 100 calorie jello smoothie snacks. Because something magical happens when you blend just the right amount of fruit with just the right amount of milk. Something that makes people go, mmm. 
Jell-O smoothie snacks because it's magic. Wherever life takes you, the world's largest hotel chain is there. With 16 standard services and amenities at all hotels in North America, Best Western gives you value, convenience, and a good night's sleep. Because wherever life takes you, Best Western is there. With over 4,000 unique locations worldwide. Visit bestwestern.com or call 1-800-WESTERN. Now through July 15th, stay at any two Best Westerns, pay with your MasterCard, and get a free night. Visit bestwestern.com for details. Oh, my. Honey, it was an accident. It could have happened to anybody. Not your mom, not in your house. That's because Kim hasn't been naked in her living room since 1956. No offense. None taken. Allie, look, this is really no big deal, right? No, of course not. Chris is a doctor. He sees naked women all the time. Do you have to say that word? Look, once I move in here, we'll... well be... Once you move in here? You didn't get the note? The node! I was about to read that when my towel fell oh, off. Oh, this is a nightmare. What did the note say? We had decided to take you up on your offer to move in here. I'm, I mean, if it's still okay. Oh, that's terrific. I've been so lonely just rattling around this old house. Wearing nothing but a towel? Well, after you move in, I'll only do that every other Tuesday. Mom, that's not funny. Chris? How about some taco salad? Mom, what? Clothes. Oh, oh. Um, Chris, I'm going to get dressed, and I'll be right back. Honey, welcome home. Mom, don't, don't. Welcome. Oh. Uh. to us. It's not that bad. Chris, you used to be my sister's boyfriend. Now you're my boyfriend. Now you just saw my mom naked. That's not normal. And what is your mom going to say when she hears about this? Allison, I'm not going to take out an ad. It's... No, this is, is an omen. Yeah, there you go again with the omens. Look, every bad thing that happens to us is not an omen. Then why do we have all of this bad luck? Because we're interesting. No, we're cursed. And do you know what that means? Do I want to know? It means that we have to do something huge so we can undo all of these bad luck that we keep getting. Like what? Maybe we should decide that the best thing to do is just not to live together. Can you tell me how to find stars yet? I have no idea. I think Dusty's the only one that might have a clue about that. And I have nothing to say about that. What is wrong with you? Lucy could have been killed. You could have been killed. Was the attack aimed at you? It's my club, so... Yeah, maybe. I think they were just trying to rip the place off. Oh, a robbery. They didn't steal anything, Dusty. They didn't have a chance to. How do I find Starzia? I don't know. Try the phone book. I have no idea how You're to reach lying. a guy like this. Will you please stay out of this? You already know I was being watched. If my family is talking, You and your family are fine. And me and Starzia, we went our different ways. I made that clear. Oh, really? Then what happened here today? Lucy walked into a situation that has nothing to do with her as it has nothing to do with you. So let's drop it. Drop it? If you need my help any time about the Starziak situation, just call me. Are we done? Not even close. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, I was just scared. They didn't hurt me or anything, though. I'm, I'm fine. Thank God. What, so what's going on with your parents? Um... Mom's upset because I was attacked in Daddy's club, and Daddy's upset because I'm leaving town early. It's not Craig's fault. Try telling her that. She's definitely not buying anything he's, he's saying. Most insensitive, stubborn man. Let's get over to your grandmother's and you can pack, and then we can leave. Okay, I just want to say goodbye to Dad first. You know, if she would have been seriously hurt It's not Craig's fault. It's his bar. She came here looking for him because he had acted like such a child at her celebration today. Who should I blame? Me. 
started with Dusty. I saw this coming. I didn't stop it. So Craig is innocent this time. And he loves his daughter. Don't forget that. I'm not happy here, Dad. I have to go. Does it have to be today? What's left to say? Every time I mess up with you, the only thing that lets me live with myself is the certain knowledge that eventually I will make it up with you. Okay? That eventually I will get this right. You think you're going to make up for a lifetime in 12 hours? Well, if anyone can, I can. True. Huh? But what are you going to do? Buy me more pearls? Take me out to dinner? Well, maybe we can go out with your mom and Gilligan. Make him sit at another table. What do you think? I think you're crazy. I am crazy about you. Tell him not to speak goodbye. Please. Stay one more day. Jordan, hi. And Jennifer. Hi. Nice to see you. Oh, um, well, you two should come on in. Uh, can I get you something to drink? No, we're just here to see Cabot. That's all we need. Cabot's still sleeping. Oh. Well, that's fine. We'll watch him while he sleeps, and then when he wakes up, we'll have a visit. Okay. Uh, Carly and I will go then. Uh, we'll be back in about ten minutes. Uh, I think I need more than a couple of minutes with my son, Rosanna. Well, I'm sorry, Jordan. I've watched you with him. You're not equipped to handle it, baby. Uh, Rosanna, I know how to feed and change a baby. It's all right. <laughs> we'll be fine. Okay. All right, well, you have my cell phone number if you need it. There's a list of emergency numbers by the phone, just in case anything happens. I'm sure we'll be able to manage. And if he needs a change, in the, uh, we've packed most of his things, but there's a bag in the closet. It's got a bunch of clothes in it. Okay, just Rosanna, in case you... they, they, can, they can handle it. Okay. We'll see you in a couple of hours. If he starts to cry, it's probably because he misses me, so call me and I will come right back. I really don't think you need to worry, Rosanna. I wasn't addressing you, Jennifer. In fact, I'm not so sure I want you around my child at all. Well, that might make a difference if I cared what you want. But I don't. Can we just get out of here and go get a cup of coffee? You want to leave a place that serves coffee and go have coffee? <laughs> All right, I admit it, you got me. I am flustered. I, I just didn't expect to see you here at, at... Wow, after all these years, I still make you blush. Am I blushing? Well, could be too much sun. No, it's you. It's always you. You gotta tell me what's going on. Okay, I can't. Hey, look, is this about Katie? I know Simon's back in town, but that's... That's all good, right? I hope so, and... You know what? This is about Katie. I've, I never should have sent her to that hospital, and I'm angry at myself, and I'm... feeling guilty. Guilty? I feel like I betrayed her. Hey, what you did, you did out of love, and that is never a bad move. Can we get out of here? I thought we'd have some lunch or something to celebrate. <gasps> your case! You won your case! Yeah, well, you're married to the best district attorney in Oakdale. The jury came back in 15 minutes flat. I had a little extra time. Thought I'd come watch you play your last set, and we'd celebrate. I just, I wish you'd gotten here sooner. Hey. You gotta tell me what's going on. Coming up on As the World Turns, Jordan bonds with Cabot the way I think he will. He's gonna try and take him from me. I'm sure of it. Something else going on. Pill every day wasn't hard. Having to remember it was. That's why I put on the patch. Mm. Or so Evra. One whisper thin patch, once a week, 
one less thing to think about every day. And does it work? Absolutely. Absolutely. It's 99% effective, just like the pill. You can put it here, here, or here. But can it really stay stuck for seven days? Yes, it can. And it does. The contraceptive patch contains hormones similar to those in birth control pills. Serious risks include blood clot, stroke, and heart attack. Cigarette smoking increases these risks, especially if you're over 35. Patch users are strongly advised not to smoke. Women with blood clots, certain cancers, a history of heart attack or stroke, and those who could be pregnant should not use the patch. The patch does not protect against HIV or sexually transmitted diseases. To learn more, talk to your healthcare professional. Like they say, it's birth control that's on your body and off your mind. Ortho Abra. of us don't get enough calcium, but with three dairy servings a day, it's easy. One, two, three. It's easy. Have you had your three today? Fact. Millions of germs thrive on your kitchen surfaces. If you're using a sponge and an ordinary cleaner, you might as well be doing this. Fact. Lysol Antibacterial Kitchen Cleaner kills 99.9% .9 of germs that other ordinary cleaners don't. And for cleaning tough grease, no other leading brand is better. For my family, I trust Lysol. Life demands Lysol. That's a fact. My mother taught me to look at art and color. So when she was losing her sight to macular degeneration, we were both devastated. Bausch & Lomb Preservision. No other vitamin is clinically proven effective by the National Institutes of Health ARID study. Now when I look in her eyes, I see hope. Go to the vitamin aisle for Preservision from Bausch & Lomb for 150 years perfecting vision, enhancing life. This week, our super stylist David Evangelista travels to the malls in glitzy Las Vegas giving mall makeovers. Get some ideas you can try on your own at home all this week on The Early Show. One night only. This Sunday, Broadway gets big. Broadway gets bold. Broadway celebrates its best. Live from Radio City Music Hall in New York City, the 2004 Tony Awards, hosted by Hugh Jackman. One night only. Be there on CBS. Today in Living It Up with Allie and Jack, Sarah Ferguson, the Duchess of York, tells us how to shape up for summer. And silver flip-flops, aviator sunglasses, we've got the hottest must-have summer accessories. Plus, your man will look like a million this summer. We've got the ultimate designs in beachwear. So stay with us. I had gastric bypass surgery three years ago. Since then, I've lost 140 pounds and kept it off. I don't think you can ever know what it feels like to be obese unless you've actually lived through the looks on people's faces when you walk into a room. I chose the Barracks Clinic because they're America's leader in bariatric surgery, and that's all they do. I mean, what else is there to say? Their dedicated staff knew what I was going through, what I was feeling, and how demoralizing it was. Everyone on their team is a specialist, and that gave me real confidence. You might say I had such a great experience with Barracks that I decided to get involved with the Barracks Clinic team. My name is Susan, and I've always wanted to be able to help people but I never took the opportunity because I was embarrassed about my weight. Now I am proud to be a Barracks Clinic support group leader. Visit our website or call today for up-to-date news and information. Get to know Barracks Clinics, America's leader in bariatric surgery. Derek Blakely and Marianne Childers, now on at 4, only on CBS2 News. Push to the limit. I'm going to flip out. The new Amazing Race premieres July 6th. Whoa. What was that about? I want you to take me home. Okay, why don't you tell me what's going on? I want you to take me home, and I want to make love to you. Just you. I want to put everything out of my mind. Everything. I want it to be just you and me.
Rosanna's just feeling a little overprotective today. That's all. Right, Rosanna? Right. That's it. Uh, yes. Uh, sorry, Jennifer. I apologize. I think you two should really get going. Absolutely. Okay. Like this, you're just making everything worse. You don't understand what's going on here, Carly. You don't understand at all. He's beautiful. Yep. He looks like you. Yeah, I, I mean, I didn't think so until I found out he was mine, but now I, I can't believe I didn't see it. Oh, damn. What? Oh, I, I bought a little rattle for him, but, um, I left it in the car. I wanted to give him something. I mean, I, it, it's not much, but uh, that's if, if he even wakes up while I'm here. Okay. That is. I'll go get it for you. Oh, wait, wait. First rule of parenting, never wake a sleeping child. Sorry, but uh, I didn't want to miss my chance to do this. What did he talk you into? Nothing. Now, Daddy understands that I have to go. I assume there'll be no problem with me showing up at the airport? As long as you promise to be polite to Alan. To who? Oh. My husband. Ah, oh, yes. Yes, I keep forgetting, since you forgot to inform anybody about casting off with Popeye, including your daughter, until you arrived here. You know, I don't remember getting a phone call from you about you meeting Rosanna. Lucy met Rosanna almost as soon as I did. Because I respect Lucy's right to have some input into the people I invite into my life. And you're having her live with somebody she barely knows? Could you guys have this argument another time? You're right. I'm sorry, sweetheart. Thank you, Lou. Mm -hmm. Me too. Mm -hmm. All right. You can meet us at the airport in a couple of hours. Oh. Well, why don't we all just get coffee first or something? Daddy could come? I would love a latte, actually. I'm sure you would. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and Aunt Lily could come as well, to referee. Uh, uh, yes, I love lattes as well. Sure, I'd love to. Come on. Mm -hmm. We'll be right there. You know, if you tried to talk her out of coming... No, 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 no. This is her way of giving her loving daddy a little more time. See, she has your kindness and your loving heart. And your charm. Yeah. Let's go get a coffee. You know what we call guys like you in my business, Dusty? Uncooperative. I get that a lot, right, Mo? You know what I think the real trouble is, Hal? He's proud of it. So are you going to be able to track down Starziak? Sure. But can we pin this assault on him? I doubt it. They'll be back, you know. Then I better be ready. What the hell is wrong with you, Dusty? You know what a dangerous guy Starziak is, and now he's not only coming after you, he's gonna hurt anybody who's in his way. Lucy, Lily, me. Do you not care what happens to us? Don't worry, all right? Nothing like this is ever gonna happen. Oh, no? And you just let our best defense walk out the door. Do you feel twisted, bloated, and constipated? Is your body telling you something's wrong, but you're not sure why? If you have recurring abdominal pain or discomfort, bloating, and constipation, you may have IBS with constipation. 
Now there's a medicine for women that works at the source of the problem. Prescription Zelnorm. Only Zelnorm's proven to relieve the symptoms of IBS with constipation. Unlike laxatives and fiber, only Zelnorm helps coordinate the nerves, muscles, and fluid in your GI tract so it starts functioning more normally and you can start feeling better. Zelnorm is only indicated for women. You should not take Zelnorm if you have a history of diarrhea, kidney, liver, or gallbladder disease, intestinal blockage, or adhesions. If you get new or worse abdominal pain, blood and stool, bad diarrhea, or diarrhea with cramping, fainting, or dizziness, stop taking Zelnorm and tell your doctor. Ask your doctor about getting relief with Zelnorm. Zelnorm, be yourself again. We brought New Hidden Valley Spicy Ranch to the land of spicy. Me encanta este aderezo, sabe sabor a chiles, chiles sabrosos y suaves, deliciosos, y un poquito picante, como a mí me gusta. Es mero, mero, es ranch verdadero, se nota que rico, es espeso, cremoso, picoso. Cool Ranch with a little kick from Hidden Valley. There. Yeah, no, didn't do it. Itchy rash, a problem? Not anymore. New Cordaid cooling spray with hydrocortisone stops itch on contact. Cordaid, the cool way to stop the itch. Hudson, remind me never to wear my favorite outfit on a flight again. A uh, rough re-entry, madam. Rough? This isn't even my dinner. Do you have some expensive miracle cleaner that can save this? I'll see what I can do. She thinks I use expensive detergent to get her clothes clean. So imagine how surprised she'd be if she knew I used all detergent. It's a first-class detergent for an economy price. It's clean. I'll wear it tonight. I can die happy. We changed to a low-carb lifestyle, and we love it. But I worried we were missing something from our diet. So we changed our multivitamin, mm. too. Introducing One A Day Carb Smart, a complete multivitamin with more biotin, an important nutrient that helps your body break down the extra fats and proteins you're eating, plus higher levels of key nutrients you may be missing when you change to a low-carb lifestyle. It just seemed smart. One A Day Carb Smart, the multivitamin with more for your low-carb lifestyle. Thursday, Joan's parents are out of town. Now God wants her to throw a party. Who are these people? Isn't this what you expected? I just do what I'm told, dude. Joan of Arcadia, special night, Thursday. It's the CBS Summer of Fun. <laughs> Twelve new strangers move into the Big Brother house, and we've got big surprises for them. Uh, Bring it on, let's go. No privacy, no outside contact. They have no idea what they're in for. Kick off the summer right with the CBS Summer of Fun. Yes! Big Brother 5 from your CBS Tuesday, July 6th. I'm just saying, let's not make this any bigger than it has to be. Okay, I, you don't want to live with my parents. And I'm cool with that, but I'm not going to throw away what we have just because you've got naked relatives running around. And what is that? You want to make me say it? Because I love you, Allison. I love you more than anything. No, I wouldn't have really let you go. I would have come up with some way else to break the curse. <laughs> mm. And that's where the real terror begins. Yeah, but what if bad things keep happening? I mean, what if there's some, supposed to be like this big lesson we're supposed to learn from all this, but we just miss it? That lesson could be knocked first. And now that everybody's in a good mood, Mom, I'm... I knew it. I knew it. He taught you to stay, didn't he? Just until tomorrow. Is that really that bad? Yes, because tomorrow he'll make another plea. How do you think he managed to keep me married to him year after year after year? I thought it was the papaya cream rubs, Princess. If I give Daddy the next few hours, he's... He's not going to put any more pressure on me, right? Well... If you don't promise, I'm out of here before I finish my latte. I promise. Don't rush off, ladies. Okay. Oh. All right. Enjoy your time together. Don't miss that flight. Can't okay. wait to have you home. I'll be there. Mm. Lullaby. You don't know how happy you've made me. Mm. What are you doing? What do you think I'm doing?
told you no one's getting hurt, right? So you're gonna go after Starziak by yourself, packing a gun? Are you nuts? What if he shoots you first? The less you know, the better, trust me. Dusty, just let the cops handle this and stay out of it, please. What's wrong with you? I didn't know you cared so much. What's going on? I didn't know I cared so much either. Okay, but I do. And I don't want to be sitting in the ICU waiting for the doctor to come out and tell me you're dead, okay? That's not gonna happen to me. I can't let you do this. You're gonna call hell, babe. Look at me. That's the one sure way to get me killed. Do you hear me? So don't do that. Why can't you let hell help you, Dusty? Because I'm the only one who can end this thing. Introducing Venus Divine, the only razor with new comfort-coated blades surrounded by intensive moisture strips enriched with botanical oils, giving you the closest shave for divinely smooth skin. New Venus Divine. Why bother with wimpy bargain bags? Hefty, hefty, hefty. When you could have new Hefty Ultra bags. Hefty, hefty, hefty. They're puncture resistant, strong, and thicker than ever. New Hefty Ultra bags. A man stands alone, accused of a terrible crime. It's not right. What kind of a game are you playing? You're in over your head, Jim. Nobody believes him. Everyone knows. Nobody. Put that in your mouth and you tell me it's light. I know what you're up to. It really is light. We slow turn it now so it tastes like regular. Unbelievably rich and creamy with half the fat. New Edie's Grand Light. She was a beauty, but her nose needed help. Allergies. Was so much out there that could get a nose in trouble. It was a case for Flonase. Only Flonase is approved to treat nasal symptoms from indoor and outdoor allergies, as well as year-round non-allergic nasal symptoms that can feel like allergies. No kidding. For best results, use daily. Side effects are generally mild and may include headache, nosebleed, and sore throat. Whether it's the usual allergy suspects or environmental offenders, talk to your doctor. All it takes is Flonase. A key, an ordinary house key. But to someone who's never had a home of their own before, a key is precious metal. It opens more than just a door. It opens up a whole new way of life. That's why Habitat for Humanity is so close to my heart. The people at Whirlpool feel the same way. Whirlpool donates a refrigerator and a range to every Habitat home. It's a good day. <laughs> and every year, thousands of Whirlpool employees volunteer their time for Habitat. <laughs> Everyone deserves a decent, affordable home. And together, we can make that happen. One family at a time. Join us. is running out of time. He runs the operation like it's all about him, and it's not good. So we're going to bring Benny down. Two men, one deadly plan. You've changed, Tony. This disrespect you're showing me now, that's only a part of it. All this time you've been going around behind my back, lying to my face. Guiding Light, the look that's got you hooked. CBS Daytime. You guys ready for lunch? Mom, I know that you were talking about that taco salad, but I was wondering if you could make that chili instead. You know, the canned kind with the smiling donkey on the label? Because Chris has never had it, and I asked his mom once if, if she knew about it, and, and she didn't, so... Imagine. <laughs> I know. You go put your stuff away, and I'll put that chili on. Okay. Chris. Are we okay? Uh, we're fine. I was concerned about Allie for a little while. But... You won't mention this to your mother. I won't mention it. Should we just get this over <laughs> with? Either that or we never look each other in the eye again. I'm 
sorry I shocked you. Oh, I'm sorry that I embarrassed you. No, I wasn't embarrassed. I was just a little surprised. <laughs> and you can look at it this way. You'll never have to wonder if Allison will age well. You'll know. Right. Uh, thank you. Welcome home, Chris. In the house? Thank you. You know, and thanks for your discretion as well. Not a problem, Mr. Reese. Doc. Um, if you were serious about returning that favor, um, I'm officially off the clock. Uh, we could do something. I'd like that, but maybe another time. Sure. As it happens, I have other plans. Oh, well. <laughs> well, what? Well, just when you think you know everything there is to know about a woman, she decides to take 10 years off your life in one afternoon. <laughs> That's a good thing, huh? No, not good. Actually, among them very best. Haven't we been married too long for the stuff to be happening? Well, when you're hot, you're hot, you know? All right. You started the whole thing, kissing up on me at the country club. All right, you liked it. And then some. Why today? Because, Tom, we just spend so much time with work and, and Casey and life, and we need to spend more time together. Something else going on. I love you, Tom. I love you so much. I love you more. Oh. Are you going to tell me what's got you so crazed about this? Is that the way I seem? It's that Jordan wants to be alone with Cabot. What's wrong with that? Well, if he spends time with him, he's going to grow to love him the way I do. Rosanna, having two loving parents, that's a good thing. That's good for Cabot. No, not if I'm not one of those parents. I called my lawyers last night. I filled them in on the whole situation. What did they say? They said that Jordan, being Cabot's biological and legal father, has much more claim under the law to Cabot than I do. Well, you already knew that. And you also know that Jordan has no interest in being Cabot's father. Well, then why did he show up with Jennifer? Perfect little family unit. No, come on. You're jumping the gun. Well, I would rather do that than get blindsided when he decides he wants custody of Cabot. Do you really think he would do that to you? After the way I have lied and misled him, yes. It's just a visit, Rosanna. Carly, think of the way you felt the first time you held Parker or Sage, and you realized that they were all yours. It just takes a moment to fall in love. If Jordan bonds with Cabot the way I think he will, He's gonna try and take him from me. I'm sure of it. Jordan's not like you. He's a guy on the fast track. He looked pretty settled with Jennifer to me. Well, maybe Jennifer has no interest in raising some other woman's child. Uh, she was practically auditioning for the role of mommy. Not necessarily Cabot's mommy. Besides, Jordan spent weeks with Cabot without bonding. That's not gonna change in a couple of hours.
Don't worry, buddy. Daddy's here. On the next As the World Turns. And if you think you're sweating now, stars the egg. Just wait. Give him to me. Give him to me now. What are you talking about? Well, if you really want to know, search me. My secret for visibly fuller lips. It's what I put on underneath. My lipstick. New volume perfect. Lip color from L'Oreal. First, it smooths and reshapes. Then, the color...